all the time, though. It's nice to be here. I'm living out in uh, uh, BC, though. I live out in uh, supernatural British Columbia. Yeah. Well, I was pooped on by a bird the other day. Yeah, man. And it was the second time one month. So I said, that is it, man. I'm getting these birds back. Let me tell you, you got to stand outside for a long time with your pants down like this before a bird comes randomly flying through. I did. I waited it out, right? Took about two days. Finally, a sparrow comes whipping through. Boom, I nailed him, right? Clipped him on the wing. He spun off and hit the curb. I was like, yeah, wash that off, my friend. It's very satisfying. Very satisfying indeed. So because of that, I've decided to get all the animals back for the things they're doing to us. Oh yeah, man, I'm out there. I'm humping dogs' legs, huh? I'm ignoring cats, sure. I'm sucking the blood out of mosquitoes. You're gonna be itchy in the morning, my friend. I'm baffling the Sasquatch with a blurry photo of myself. I'm selling whale CDs of me making annoying noises and passing it off as music. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I've got a pet now. I've never had a pet before. I got a cat, and I was very concerned because I got a lot of germ issues. My friends tell me, don't worry, Roman. Uh, cats are very fussy when it comes to hygiene. All right? But my cat likes to lick its own ass and drink out of the toilet. <laughs> if you ask me, they're not fussy enough. I'd say that's rather carefree when it comes to hygiene. What do you say? Cats are more like risk takers. If I sat around licking my ass all day, you wouldn't call me fussy. In fact, you wouldn't call me at all. And that'd be fine, because I'd be licking my own ass. What do I want to talk to you for? <laughs> Besides, how do you hold the phone? You know what I'm saying? 